Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Emma, and we are playing Dragon Age 2. Alright, so, we didn't accomplish a whole lot last time. We're still on the search for Fainriel. So, we figured out that when we went to the docks, they'd already sold him to this human slaver dude. We went back to Darktown, beat him up. Well, well, killed him. We, we killed him. <laughs> we didn't just beat him up. And, um... We let Fenris have the honors, and now we're here on the Wounded Coast. This is where, apparently, Danzig, I think, the slaver guy, um, is storing him before the Taventers come to get him. So, let's check. Oh, shit. Slaver caverns, and then, okay. So, it looks like we've got a bit of running around to do. Let's get that done. Pile of bones. Oh. That's quite the view. It is. We should She's move so on. Oh, I'm sorry, Fenris. I wanted to click on this pile of bones. Now, um... Okay, we'll do this. Uh, my inventory is low. So, we'll, we'll, we'll make do. Glitter dust is the powdered form of a rock found among the wounded coast. When explorers brought the sparkling rock to the markets of the free marches, it became immediately popular among lovely ladies who crushed it and applied the powder to their faces. Man! <laughs> they were highlighting before it was cool. The added brightness and luster to the skin, however, soon paled in comparison to the developing rash and coughing fits. Oops. As it turned out, glitter dust is dangerous if ingested or inhaled. It's also extremely flammable, as several ladies discovered after powdering their hair while standing next to a candle. Unfortunately, this resulted in a dozen deaths by conflagration. These days, glitter dust is used sparingly and only by experienced alchemists. The most common form of the substance is volatile glitter dust. If gathered from caves where darkspawn dwell, the rock produces a powder known as tainted glitter dust. So, could this be like the explosive bullshit that the dwarf we ran into last time was talking about? I mean, it is combustible. Oh. Oh, what? Why? No. I mean, guys, why didn't you even pick a fight? Messing with us is suicidal. Is that the terror calls in the back giving his pep talk? <laughs> I will always take health potions. Hopefully, when we have items of the same sort, they stack and don't take up additional room in our bags. That would be nice. Who are these people? Dalish! Dalish! Do you even know her name, Shem? No? It's Denila. She's dead. And you killed her. Uh oh. This doesn't look good. I'm not a werewolf. How many times do I have to say it? You're... You're crazy. Lies! Help! This crazy elf is going to kill me! Holy fuck! Okay, so if you guys aren't putting this together, this is probably one of the Dalish elves of Zathrian's clan. Back, back, back from the forest that we were in that I don't remember the name of, but the one that was, that was affected by that curse that he put on them. He doesn't look like a werewolf, Dalish. He seems harmless. He hides in human form. Do not let him fool you. P please. She's scaring me. Oh, but I don't know. Is he actually a werewolf? I thought we killed them all. I thought we killed them all. I can just see, like, people hovering over there. <laughs> over their keyboards or, you know, towards their TVs. <laughs> um, because I don't know how I'm going to handle this. Fuck. I'm really tempted to look this up. Because you know me, I'm going to err on the side of the Dalish. Especially if there's a lingering dude. But, 
But there's no evidence here. There's no evidence that this dude's a werewolf. I don't know what to do. Okay, I gotta look this shit up. I'll be right back. Don't worry, the next part is coming right up. Okay, I wasn't able to find a whole lot in the few minutes that I looked. Um, what I'm gonna do is if this sucks, I'm just gonna go back to our previous scene. <laughs> Cause we're like literally just a run away, right? Okay, so I would prefer that there not be any bloodshed. Please don't attack me, Danish lady. Please don't attack me. You have the wrong man. You stand up for him? Fine. Then you will die for him. I know, I know, I know. Oh no, did I not? No, it had to be right there. I hate doing this because I'm like, fuck, did I save? I don't think I saved. So let's hope this goes okay. It should just put us back on the wounded coast. Okay, great, perfect. Oh, did my inventory bullshit again. Let me fix it. Okay. Can I click on him, please? Okay. I thought all dwarves had beards. Oh, good. Where's yours? I misplaced it, along with my sense of dwarven pride and my gold-plated noble cast pin. I thought maybe it fell onto your chest. <laughs> oh, the broody elf tells a joke. I don't brood. Friend, if your brooding were any more impressive, women would swoon as you passed. They'd have broody babies in your honor. You're a very odd dwarf. And you thought I was joking about the pin. Hmm. <laughs> I'll happily go through that again. Um, he already did all this. Oh, that's quite the vi Sorry, Meryl. Keep interrupting. Okay, so we gotta do the talvish off, and then we can get over there. Are we doing this? Are we doing this legalist Gimli style? Okay, so now when I get within sight, so I remember what I'm doing, I'm going to save. Can you highlight that for me? Whatever. Oh, we'll do it the hard way. Let's do that so we know. And let's try this again. Do you even know her name, Shem? No? It's Denila. She's dead. And you killed her. Okay. Let's try this again. I'm not a werewolf. How many times do I have to say it? You're... You're crazy. Lies. Help! This crazy elf is going to kill me. He doesn't look like a werewolf, Dalish. He seems harmless. He hides in human form. Do not let him fool you. P please. She's scaring me. You better be right, or you're killing an innocent. Run, Shem. It will make the hunt more enjoyable. That didn't feel good either. I don't like either of these. Why can't I reason with her? Why can't I reason with her? That's cool. Enchanted lockets are cool. Hmm. Oh, look. Is that Fane Riel down there? Good. So let's deviate up this way really quick. If that's motherfucking spiders, nope. Bye. 
No, not today. Not today. Okay, let's just... We keep seeing corpses. I can't tell whether it's the Canari or whether this is, you know, as a result of all this trafficking and people are fighting back. This is not reassuring. Okay. <sighs> Hopefully everything turns out okay. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. That extra foreshadowing, though. Okay, guys, let's get this done. Oh, is it just plant day today? It is an old country saying that spindleweed grows best for the sorrowful. Verdant spindleweed in a household's garden has often brought neighbors offering consolation, usually without even asking what might be wrong. This originates from the plant's use as a seasoning for dishes meant to speed the recovery of the infirm. A person who grows much of it is likely caring for the fatally ill. That's depressing. So much of this game is depressing. Okay, so that, this is the top floor. Let's clear this out really quick. Oh, can we like bust through these doors or something? This is the second one we found like that. And I'm not sure whether or not there's something that we need to be doing with them. I'm like waiting for the bads. Yeah, I knew you were coming. Why are you screaming like that? Is that necessary? explore down the floor yet? No, we did not. That is important. Otherwise, we miss shit like this. I can't open. I wonder how much room we're going to have. Okay, so that's actually where we did need to go. Man, I can't believe our trip is almost funded. be even more funded when I remember to go home and sell things. <laughs> okay. This is where I was going to go. And we'll see what's up here before we double back. Is it just a whole lot of nothing? Oh my god. What is this? I hate all this. This is sad. Hello, deep mushroom. I <laughs> just interrupt the music. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right. So let's head back down this way. And then through that little passageway over here. And then we can go in. And hopefully find Fane Rail. That would be nice. I'm gonna boop you. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm Take run one in. more step. And the boy dies. Varric? Can we just have him sharpshoot? I don't know if he's gonna sharpshoot or if he's gonna negotiate. Varric, I'm depending on you, honey. Tell this dirtbag who we are. If I were you, I wouldn't be threatening the Viscount's son. What? Oh, I suppose you just got a tip from a slaver that he was selling mage flesh cheap. You never thought to ask where he got it? You never wondered if you were buying the Viscount's well-known love child from his elven mistress. The boy he swore to protect, even if it meant raising the entire free marches? Yeah. I seek no war with the free marches. Take the lad to his father.
I'm afraid if we say that we're going to kill him, he's just going to kill the boy. That's my fear here. That's why I am hesitating. Um... obviously deserves to die, but I'm afraid like if we do the after we kill you option, he's going to kill the kid. But if I don't do that one, then we're not going to be able to serve any sort of justice at all. You're dead. Time to die, little man. You're no good for me <gasps> as a corpse. Get down. Okay, thank fuck. <laughs> it is not okay to sell people. It's never okay. My throat and you just I'm sorry I mean thank you but what if you were wrong you were too valuable for him to kill is that my choice prisoner or slave who are you are you working for the Templars your mother sent me huh. hardly a difference I can't believe her my whole life it was all I'll love you and protect you then I have some bad dreams and it's off to the Templars. I'm here to help you, Fainriel. Why? You don't even know me. I am you. I guess you are. Would... Is there any chance you'd help me reach the Dalish? That's where I was trying to go. See if they'd take me in. I'm as much Dalish as human. You'd be alone among the Dalish. Even more than a Dalish would be here. Compared to being held prisoner, or made tranquil, I'll risk being lonely. Got Look, point. I know it's different in other kingdoms, but here, no one helps circle mages. Anything the Templars don't like, you get the brand. The Dalish, they've had magic forever. They could teach me. I won't be a danger, I swear. It would be your humanity that marks you among the people, not your magic. But I think they will take you. Because no Dalish mage ever went astray. Was your mother right? Are you plagued by demons already? I can't say for sure. I have... dreams. There are voices in the dreams. They ask me to come, to give shape to the void around them. But the Dalish Keeper is wise. If anyone can help, she can. I know the Keeper. I'll make sure she takes you in. Then... she does not hate humans. Oh, you don't know what a relief that is. I knew she could help me. Thank the Creators, you were the one my mother hired to find me. I will forever be in your debt, friend. We should tell the boy's mother what became of him. Yay! Fenris, we got rivalry, but we got friendship with Meryl, and I really think this is the best outcome. I'm really happy with the way that went down. That was really satisfying. I was very worried there. 
and I'm glad that everyone pitched in. I love that the characters talk and give their two cents. That was wonderful on Varric's part. What a great job. I'm really sorry I let you die, my dear sweet friend. Oh, I'm sorry I'm trying to jump. Forever. I'm always trying to jump. <laughs> Yay! This ended so well! I'm so pleased. I'm so very pleased with this. Come on. Hawk, I know you can do this. Excuse me, everyone. Thank you. It's so hard not to just spam the space bar. Because, like, whenever I get stuck in a wow or whatever, it's what you do, you know? <laughs> it's so hard, guys. It's so hard. No, but I might want that. Yes, I absolutely want that, even though it requires 21 magic. Hmm, let's see what I can do about that. I'll be right back. All right. Now, I couldn't use the staff, but Meryl can. So everybody wins. Okay, let's make sure that I explored everything. Oh wait, is this where I came in? Yeah, that looks like the way that I came in. Excuse me, I'm sorry. So let's just go out this way. Wounded coast. That ex okay, yeah, no, we're good. And I see what you guys mean by the caverns all looking the same a little bit. I, I mean, you got the same sort of doors, the same sort of like, cavey architecture, so I get that. I mean, is that the point where it bothers me? Nah. But, but that's me. Doesn't mean that everyone has to have the same experience playing. Okay, I guess we're just going to wander blindly because I have no way. For my sake, please quit cutting through the alleys in Low Town alone at night. Nothing ever happens. I'm perfectly safe, Varric. Yes, I know, and that nothing is costing me a fortune. Aww. Eric, that's so sweet. Oh, <laughs> she's so precious. All right. Ah, okay. I see. I see. That's the spider place. Okay, let's keep going this way. This is the way that we were headed. Cause that was the cave we just came out of. Music is pretty. It reminds me of WoW. Very poignantly. Uh, I am full up. There's literally nothing else I can do about it right now. But I'm gonna check everything anyways. No, shit. Apparently that shit doesn't stack. I mean, worst case scenario, if we find what, what, if we find ourselves low on funds, we can come back and buy shit. Did I say buy shit or find shit? I can't remember. Concentrate. <laughs> All right. No, I want to take everything and I can't. Can I at least have some gold? Should I just like run back to town really quick and then come back? That might be the best way to do this. It'll be, well, it's not like you guys are going to have to do that. I'm going to do that. So let me read this real quick and that's what I'll do. Because I don't want to waste the stuff that we're coming across. The Wounded Coast. One of the few roads leading into Kirkwall passes through a dangerous area known as the Wounded Coast. The road winds close to the cliff edge, but looms over waters with many a precipitous drop to the churning waves below. There's many a local legend involving travelers falling, or jumping, having been flung from those heights. From the cliffs, the road leads through jagged hills that line the pass like sharp teeth. Bandits use these hills as cover from which to ambush caravans. There's more to fear here than bandits, of course. Once one leaves the hills, you come upon a maze of sharp canyons, the hunting grounds for many fierce creatures. It is a place of secrets dating back to the golden age of the Tevinter Imperium, where ancient relics and statues crumble in time with the rocks. Ooh, and I got another achievement for that. Cool. Okay, I'm going to 
run back to town and I am going to sell my bullshit and then come back. Okay, I figured while we're here, we might as well, um, talk to Vicento. Why are you watching me like that? You have Valaceline. The same markings that the Dalish have. Yours are not made of lyrium. No, they're made of blood. Our blood. That's what Valaceline means. Blood writing. It's a mark of adulthood. Mine were carved into my flesh against my will. In a ritual I remember only for the agony it caused me. I'm so sorry. At least she's sympathetic. Looks like they're finding mutual ground. I do not wish to discuss my personal life. Let me do what you want to see my words. Okay, that's fine. I thought you might want to know about your kid, but that's also cool. Okay, I'm gonna sell my shirt. I'll be right back. Alright, we did everything. So let's go... Tell his mom real quick while we're already here, and then we can go back and finish our Canary quest. I'm kind of disappointed in. I mean, I'm already give a fuck now. I guess disappointed in Vincenzo that is. I didn't finish my thought all the way. It's just sad, you know. <laughs> At least give a little bit of a fuck, right? Because you can't make people be good people. There we go. That's what I want. Your son decided he'd rather be an elf than a Templar prisoner. He joined the Dalish. What? But he is human. They did not even wish me to raise him among them. But they do value magic more than the men of Karkor. Perhaps he can have both safety and freedom. As I said, I have little money. But this is a Dalish ring that has been in my family for generations. Please accept it with my thanks. Greetings. Yeah. I do love that these people like chat all the time. Okay, so. I am going to quickly fast travel us back to where we were. You've probably never met a Dalish before, have you? I wouldn't know. I'm sure you'd be able to tell. Dalish aren't much like the elves in the cities. The smug sense of superiority does give you away. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, just a little bit more running. Okay. Thank you. Now we can continue on our journey. Now that I can stuff things in my pockets again. I think we're at like 39 gold or something now? We're almost there. Like I was worried about it, but you know, we've done really well. Okay. Let's loot this business. Oh. I feel kind of bad just like exterminating all these people. But I said I would not turn down any So I guess sometimes we have to get our hands a little dirty, unfortunately. But I mean, like, I'm still really pleased with how the Fane Royale thing turned out. Hopefully, um, we can go back to Keeper Marathari and even, like, check on him. Oh, that'd be so cool. That would be really cool. I would like that a lot. We might have to do that at some point. This is, like, the never-ending maze of Elfroot! of stuff. Okay, so we don't really collect herbs, we just get recipes. And then how do we get mats for the recipe? Mats being the short term for materials. What? I don't even wake Bianca for every thread anymore. I'm hurrying. Kinda. Is there anything else? 
There's so many piles of bones. People are not doing well on this island. Our coast. Okay, so that leaves the area. So that's not where I want to go. Let's go up this path. No oh. further, human. Calvishoff control these passages. Ambushes are usually quieter, Kunari. I did not intend to ambush. I expected to warn a caravan, but you are not helpless. The path ahead is littered with my kind. If you are as skilled as you look, it would please me if you killed them. And I should trust you. I have no history of betraying your people, only my own. I did not like my role, so I left the queue. I do not wish to be a murdering thief, so I left these Talvishoff to warn their victims. You are no victim. So now, I will leave. I would prefer a peaceful way through. I want a friendly way to get what I need. You will be disappointed. They are reveling in chaos. It is a wretched freedom. I still need order, even if I insult the court of the Kuhn by selling my honor as a mercenary. Because we're not hurting for gold, so let's do it. If your blade is on the market, I'll pay. No. Are you sure you know what mercenary means? <laughs> Taking payment to face Tal Vashon only proves that I've sold the last of myself. I know what I am. I don't need to belabor it. You have my word of caution, human. Heed it or do not. The more they talk, the less I understand. Okay. Um, I heard people yelling. So let's... We gotta do this, right? Okay, so that way was a dead end. Okay. Well, hold on, let me check how good we are on time. Uh, I think we push a little bit more. Don't get mad, bro. I'm gonna prefer this to not be what you're doing right now. Resisted? No, don't resist. <laughs> Oh, barrel! <laughs> she says excitedly. <laughs> All right. Oh, heads on pikes. My favorite. I'm just gonna loot this dude. You be chill. Okay. Here we go! Next batch. Let's do this. Yeah, I definitely don't want Oh, behind us? Oh, I'm sorry. It's so hard to click when they're moving. You get him, baby. Boy. Okay. Cave. What? Where? What? What is this? Oh, you're just in the bushes. I thought it was like some beast or something. Varric, let's try. I know you can't do you it. You want me to do what? But I always I like so. to make sure. All right. The Arlesian Empire. There are many lords and ladies in Valrio. And I mean this literally. Once, the system of noble titles in Orlais was labyrinthine. There were barons and barons, and baronets, and sir barons, and a horde of others, each with its own origins and its own nuance of comparison. The Orlesian aristocracy is ancient and much given to competition. All the nobility play the grand game, as it is known. 
whether they wish to or not. It is a game of reputation and of patronage, where moves are made with rumors and the scandal is the chief weapon. No gentle game, this. More blood has been drawn as a result of the grand game than any war the Elysians have fought. Of this, I am assured by almost every gentleman here. As far as titles went, everything changed with the coming of Emperor Drakon, who established the Elysian Empire as it exists now, and who created Chantry. There is no more venerated figure in Orlais. In Valvoyo, the statue of Drakon stands as tall as the statue of Andraste. Drakon determined that the Grand Game was tearing Orlais apart, so he abolished all titles besides his own, and Lord and Lady. <clears throat> I am told, with some twittering amusement, that this action did not end the grand game as Drakon had intended. Now the lords and ladies collected unofficial titles rather than official ones, such as the exalted patron of Tassus Play, or uncle to the champion of Tremens. It is a headache to remember such titles, and one winces to think of the poor doormen at the balls who must rattle them off as each guest enters the room. The aristocracy is different from Ferelden in other ways as well. The Orlesians' right to rule stems directly from the Maker. There exists neither the concept of rule by merit, nor the slightest notion of rebellion. If one is not noble, one aspires to be, or at the least aspires to be in the good graces of a noble, and is ever watching for a way to enter the patronage of those better placed in the grand game. And then there are the masks. And the cosmetics. I have not seen so much paint since the kennels at High Ever. Ha, that's a Mabari joke. But that is another story. I assume that's a, a Mabari joke. Okay. Oh, we got some more. Let's do this. <laughs> No, I just want to click on the dare approach. Uh oh, thank you, Fenris. Why are you guys in the bushes? I can't get you. Maybe. Oh! He's like standing there booping me, and I'm just like talking smack. Fenris. 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 Get a Meryl. With her smack talk, it's so cute. <laughs> I didn't know I could go over here. Cool. Ah, uh, these are where they were chilling. This is where they were chilling. Okay, top of the cabin. Let's go. Ah. Uh, hmm. What foreshadowing is this? I'm not sure. This might be a good point to, uh, to call it a day. So we will pause here and I may or may not keep recording. We'll have to see. I've got to see how much time I've got. Uh, my best friend's flying in from Vancouver today, so I need to clean my house. <laughs> That's important. <laughs> okay, well, I hope you guys had a lot of fun with this. I had a lot of fun with this. Um, even though we had to go and adjust some of our decisions. I think the Fane Real stuff went really, 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 really well. So I'm pleased. Okay. I hope that everyone has a great rest of their day. And I will see you next time.